Wherever you are in Outlook.com, there's a drop-down menu at the top left of your screen that lets you get to People, that's your contacts. To find one of your existing groups, start typing its name in the search box near the top left. One of my groups is the Aardvark Appreciation Society, so I start typing, there it is, and I click on it. I could tick or check the groups box, but if I do, then I can no longer see the members and I can no longer edit them. So I untick the box, click on the group again, then to add a member I go to the toolbar and click edit and I get a box entitled add member and I can start typing the name of a contact in that box. When I start typing there are some options. I'm going to add Andy Damson to the group and then if I start typing again some more options appear and this time I'm going to add Andy Fig. Then all I need to do is click on save and those two people are added to the group. If I want to delete a group member, then I click on edit once again. When I do so, I'll find there's a cross by each group member. And if I click on a cross, that person will be removed from the group. Andy Banana is removed from the group and I save the action. And that's it.